periods is one of a major challenge faced by every women on a monthly basis many women feel very discomfort and also cramps during this time do you think doing exercise and maintaining a healthy weight is possible even at this time yes definitely you can keep yourself active but please avoid jogging running and skipping at this time because already you will be very tired due to the heavy blood flow instead you can do walking at this time because walking is a very mild exercise and it is advisable at all times i am going to teach you some yoga exercises which helps you reduce the anxiety and the cramps faced at this time These yoga poses are specifically designed during the menstrual time. Start the yoga by first relaxing yourself. Sit flat on the surface. Close your eyes and slowly inhale and exhale the air. Feel the breath, feel the surrounding and slowly relax yourself. The first yoga which we are going to do is Baddha Konasana. Padakonasana is specifically designed to do during the menstrual time. This helps relax your muscles. Now slowly bring your legs to this position. The two feet should touch each other. And then slowly bend and touch your feet. Try to make your legs flat as possible so that it touches the surface. Don't try too hard but slightly try to make it flat. Now slowly bend and touch your foot. This posture is also called like a butterfly posture. Slowly lift your legs and then spread again. This way you will relax the uterus muscles and it will also help you relieve the pain. So when you have a menstrual cramp this yoga pose is very very beneficial for you. The next yoga pose we are going to learn is Janu Sirasana or the head to knee pose. This yoga is specifically useful for reducing your thigh muscles and also relax the muscles around the uterus. Stretch out one of your leg. Then fold the other leg so that the heel touches the inner thigh. Now slowly bend and touch the other toe. When doing this you have to properly inhale and exhale the air. Do not hold your breath at any point of time. Slowly inhale and exhale as you do this pose. Now you can do the same pose in the other way too. You can stretch out the other leg and fold the other leg to the inner thigh. Do this like 10 to 15 counts on each leg. This pose will specifically help you to relieve the muscle pain around the thighs and also reduce your thigh muscles. This pose is very very useful during the menstrual time. Next yoga pose we are going to learn is Upavishta Konasana. This yoga is very helpful to reduce the belly fat. Spread out your legs wide as much as you can. Now We are going to touch the toes by bending forward. When you are bending forward, there is a pressure on the belly fat. This pressure helps you reduce the belly fat. When you are bending, try to bend as much as possible so that you are touching the surface. I am trying as much as I can. When you practice this yoga on a regular basis, you can bend forward even more flat. So this yoga is specifically helpful to reduce the belly fat. Try to practice this regularly even when you are not having your periods. The next yoga is Paschimottanasana or the seated forward bend. This is like a regular exercise. When you do this, definitely there is a pressure built up around your belly fat. So this is specifically helpful to reduce the belly fat and the thigh muscles. So sit and then bend forward and try to touch your toes as much as possible. When you are bending, your head should touch your knees as close as possible. Initially, you will not be able to do it perfectly, but when you practice this yoga pose regularly, then definitely you can touch your head with the knees. 
This yoga pose is very helpful to reduce the thigh fat and the belly fat. The next yoga pose we are going to learn is Supta Bada Konasana or the Goddess Pose. This yoga pose is specifically designed during periods because it is so relaxing to mind and body. So now to do this yoga, lay flat on the surface. Bend your legs so that both of your feet touch each other. When you do this way, there is a lot of relaxation around the muscles of belly, thigh and the uterus. So all the muscles will be relaxed when you do this yoga pose. This is a very perfect pose to do during your periods and it also helps to reduce your belly fat and also relaxes your back muscles. So friends, these are the yoga poses to do during your periods time. This help you relieve pain and also maintain a healthy weight even during your periods time. So friends, start practicing this yoga along with 30 minutes of walking every day and you can maintain and reduce your weight very easily. If you like the video, please do subscribe my channel because I will be posting more useful videos like this. Thank you.